Welcome back, everyone, to the next installment of No More Heroes. We're going for the number one. The Last Assassin. The Grand Finale. I know it was a little bit grindy last episode, but believe me, there was more grinding to be had. One thing I have to show you, I mean, of course, I'll do it in the mission itself, is the charge attack for the sword. You've seen them all before, but the Tsubaki Mark III's is a lot more involved. And it homes. And you're invincible when you do it. There's like, there's no downside. So first of all... Uh, right, I forgot to go back to the motel first. Let's hear what Sylvia has to say. She does appear to be getting more emotionally invested in us, so... Guess it's good for Travis. Help me out. Why didn't I call this number in the first place? Uh, hello? Hello? May I ask who's calling? This is the Assassin's Association, right? Look, I gotta talk to you about... Oh, dear. She's done it again, hasn't she? Hey, are you listening? Excuse me for asking, but are you by chance an assassin? Whoa, don't tell the whole world. <laughs> then you have been had, sir. You are not her first. What? Run that by me again. Listen to me. Do not get involved, whatever you do. Listen, lady. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Who are you, anyway? Another sorry kid. And for the record, I am Sylvia's mother. Oh, boy. boy. Yes, you heard me. And there's no such thing as an association, or whatever you think exists. You're joking, right? Do you know how many people I've killed? She is a professional con artist. You mean a fraud? Are you telling me this was all just bullshit? She set everything up. Would you mind telling me how far this all went? Uh... Now second in rank. So, just one more to go. All right. Why not play along since you've come this far? Are you serious? What's the point? This is all some make-believe charade. But a good man finishes what he started. Fight to the end. Your most formidable opponent awaits in the castle. Now, off to the Garden of Madness. That's weird and a half. Number one. That. Bitch. But aw, Jean's hanging under the ceiling fan. But number two. How does the mother know where the last assassin is? Or does this happen every time? And why the hell would she mention the Garden of Madness? Is that why Sylvia mentions it? What? Did you see the helmet on the driver? Because that looked exactly like the TIE fighter pilots. Remember, with the, they're basically stormtroopers with their black helmet? That looked exactly like a freaking TIE fighter pilot. Driving my X-Wing. <laughs> well, good thing I got the technique of child, or I would be pissed right now. So let's move down. Oh boy. Is this actually helping my speed? A little bit. Oh, what the hell, does that charge? Someone really screwed me over. I have got to kill whoever that was. Oh, whoops. Yeah, that's why you don't want the meter to run out, because it loses even more time. I want my bike back. And this is really across town. Seriously, if I didn't have the lava cough ball, this would be a freaking nightmare to watch. It's already pretty painful. Oh, I think that's it. I see a little red. Or is that just the free mission? I still didn't beat that free mission, by the way. It pissed me off. Nah, no, that's it. Looks like... We're taking the freeway? 
We've driven by here before, but we couldn't go up. Dark Star. Now that's intimidating. Also, the villain of Slayer's Try. So can I get a can I get a hand raising of all two people who've seen that? I love this song. Oh, really? I wonder. Nice. I don't think I can drift. Did he just fire at me? This guy's freaking dead. I love how you just destroy these guys when you hit them. You know, I played this far before Shenmue, but this reminds me of the part in Shenmue where you gotta get back to hit to your house extremely quickly after heading out to the uh, the docks. It's just like, it plays like hang on and it's actually pretty hard. The timer is very strict. This one's behind me, I can see it on the radar. There we go, yep. Oh no! That was the most elaborate not fall off sequence ever. <laughs> Good job, idiot. Oh, time to go. Alright, we're getting off. Someone's behind me again. Get in front. Get in front. Oh yeah, enjoy that. I think this part actually requires jump... Bing. Here it is. Ah, nuts. Fortunately, it's just a little health penalty. Crap. God, you really have to jump early. Why did that hurt me? Yeah. Here it goes. Perfect. Jesus. I forgot about that. Ah, damn it. Looks like I'm done. This is why they gave me the bike jump for my job. Glorious. Oh, that was awesome. Oh no, my bike! Well... Five cards left in the game. Now there's four. Thunder Ryu. Sometimes the dead ends have... okay. Sometimes the dead ends have uh, the wrong ways of chests. This is one of those things, if you go the wrong way, it'll just send you... You. It'll just send you backward. Was that Henry? Hey, he's over here. No, no, it's just some... Okay, never mind, I was wrong. I was like, why were you here? Did you catch that? I'm fighting TIE Fighter Pilots. Okay. 
Okay, I want to go left. Okay, turn back. I'm testing each of these dead ends. Oh yeah, I didn't show you the charge attack. I better get on that. This is a rather interesting level, isn't it? Watch this. Every part of that flip counts as an attack, by the way. It's insane. Right is the way to go. <laughs> What's that? Invincibility? Two cards left. We're almost there. I'm killing all sorts of TIE Fighter pilots. It's a lot of goons. Okay, pointing left. It's important that I get there quickly so I can see Thunder Ryu. You see how cool that is? The charge attacks on the old lightsabers would kill my battery. This? Infinite battery upgrade. One card left in the game. Outside of a new game plus, of course. Okay. You never know. At least in a new game plus, I think some chests are down the wrong paths. Here goes. Travis, that. Path of Men is not Path of Beasts, you know. You know, your edge can be poison or cure. To be learned is the path. And to be ignorant, excuse me, to be learned, and to be ignorant is also the path. Your path, your path is that. A path that no one, nothing can pass, yet the path reach on. Devotion is only given to those who perfect single thing. Reward then. No reward those who do not perfect, or do not perfect. Does a reward or just evil lie down your path? Fight until you die, Travis. Thunder Ryu. You're the man, Thunder Ryu. Done. Last phone call of the game. Travis, can you hear me? Sylvia, I never thought you'd make it this far. But I am sorry. I cannot see you anymore. I want to fly to your side right now. Oh, I'll I bet. want to be in your arms. I want to be with you. I want to share my life with you. No matter the cost. Meeting you, I felt truly alive for the first time. I mean that. But feelings and reality are two different things. Life is not that simple, yes? Now, be honest. Did you really think I would let you do me if you hit number one? You really are an idiot, aren't you, Travis? Come back to reality. I mean, look at yourself. You are a dopey otaku assassin. The bottom of the barrel. 
No woman would be caught dead with you unless she was a desperate bitch. Where in the world could you find a woman who could fall in love with someone like you? Well, one is right here. It was fun, Travis. I love you. Now, don't forget to use the restroom. Trust your force and head for the garden of madness. Oh, it's on now. No mask. Yes. This is the best part. The restroom is a freaking... Just like toilet paper on a tree. That's freaking genius. That That is amazing. What a decision. Forest of Bewilderment. Yeah. That just keeps going. Let's do it. Dark Star. Get the Darth Vader breathe. Welcome to my castle. Jeez. I heartily receive you, my son. All right, enough with the jokes. A joke? You don't remember me, Travis. I am your true father. Uh Blood does not make such mistakes. <laughs> Jeez, you are full of it, aren't you? Oh my god. Um... It's a good story. I'll give you that much. You see, this is just another story. Even if you were my father, it doesn't matter. The only thing that matters here is who's best. Remember, son. Engraved into your memory is the night when everything changed. I fell to my feet right before my son's eyes. Do you not remember this? In my deepest memories, I hear someone calling. I remember. It was a hot summer day. There was someone standing behind my father and mother. That person killed my parents. The face, I can't make it out. Who are you? Remember. Who are you? Try harder. I think I can see it. Almost. Do you recognize the face? Now I remember everything. Well done, son. She was the girl you loved. Ow. Still as gullible as ever, Travis. Think, why would he be your father? <laughs> Making fun of the whole Star Wars trope right there. I guess you're right. I don't have a father. At least not anymore. You killed him, didn't you? Yes. And that's why you became an assassin. Our ex-girlfriend, Jean. Now I get it. All those fights. It was for this. I lost everything that I ever cared about. That bitch took everything! I can help you to get even. Interesting. She's a good con artist, that's for sure. She set up some killer fights. So you and I finally meet. You should thank Sylvia. 
Jean, there's just one thing I want to ask you. Who are you? Me? You don't need to know. All of your trivial questions will be answered in the afterlife. Answer me! It's impossible. Impossible? What do you mean? It's too terrible. It alone would jack up the age rating of this game even further. <laughs> so what? Who cares? What if the game gets delayed? You don't want this to become No More Heroes Forever, do you? <coughs> All right. I'll fast forward this so you can tell me. Okay. I'll make it short and quick. This is messed up. <laughs> Brother, you know that manga called Miyuki, the Japanese one? Well, it's like that. Your father abandoned my mother to run off with your mother. It broke her heart beyond repair. She killed herself, knowing I had nowhere to go. He took advantage of me. Ever since I can remember, he molested me. We lived in this rotten apartment, and I was his slave. Every day, I cursed his soul. I swore that I would kill him one day, but cursing didn't change anything. That's when I decided to become a killer. With no money to pay for training, I paid with my body. But to you, <laughs> I bet that son of a bitch looked like a hard-working family man. That was all an act. He didn't give two shits about cleaning up my life, so I decided to clean it up myself. That's why I do what I do, and I got what I wanted, killing him in front of your very eyes. That's my story. Imagine that. You and I, brother and sister. Now you see what I We been dated through. our sister. Maybe it had to be done, but vengeance begets vengeance. You're right. Go ahead. Draw, brother. All of your sorrows end today, Jean. You know, we didn't know she was a sister. But she knew. <laughs> An Ouroboros, how appropriate. You want to see a real party? Watch this. She's a quick gun. She dodges the goddamn dark step. <laughs> That's when you hit her. I gotta let her get that shot off. You just can't lay a hand on her. I know what I'll do. Dodge this! Jeez. I want a stunner to show you something. You cannot throw her. Oh, she's unthrowable. Let's cheat. Dodge this. Go ahead. I'm the last one. She is the last one. Let's do this. Come on. Yeah. 
<laughs> Come on. Does she have an ultra move? I gotta see. Come on, do it. Do something. Whoa. That's kind of cool. That speed is just ridiculous. Oh, it's his freaking weapon that's the dividing line. <laughs> God, imagine if you had to fight Darkstar. God help you. I just love that. She dodged the goddamn Dark Step. There's no way. Whoa. Okay, I grow bored of this. One more. It's over. Oh! That's right, you can't win that one. That's right! Do it! Right. Brother, please don't kill me! Sorry, Jean. This hurts me too. We're both in the same business, after all. And I've had enough time for you to rest Jean good night Travis I hope your next dream is a more pleasant one that is brutal it's over this is where it all ends right Sylvia And it still pays. Good for New Game Plus money. Con, though she may have done, she did bring me Jean. Oh, yes. <laughs> Excuse me for a second. This is where it gets weird. Few ending few real ending. Here's the thing. From what I've heard, if you did not buy that absurdly expensive $999,999 energy thing for the Beam Katana, this wouldn't even be an option. So it would be, do you want to go back and find stuff? Or do you want to view the ending? First of all, let's view the ending. It's finally over. Guy get some privacy? At least when he's taking a dump? I'm afraid not. These fights don't work like that. It's time to die, Mr. First Rank. You gotta be shitting me. <laughs> <laughs> the music even starts off like Star Wars music. I cannot get over that. Oh. <sighs> Freaking brilliant, man. Freaking brilliance. And by the way, that mystery person who came in and attacked us, that was no coincidence. That was actually another Killer7 reference. You see, he looked remarkably like Garcian Smith, right? Well, 
here's the thing about that. Sure enough, he looked like and was dressed like Garcian Smith. And sure enough, his name, Ermin Palmer, rather similar to Emir Parkreiner. And by the way, the game does not tell you this. I think it's just information on the character. Not only do they sound similar in terms of names and kind of similar in terms of voices and even dress similarly, but also both of them have a penchant for, uh, that is not Garcian so much as Amir, have a penchant for jumping assassins when they least expect it in the comfort of their own homes. Well, a hotel in the first game, but you know. Count that as another reference. This game is so much fun. It really, really is. But you know what? The game is not quite over. We have just one more thing to do. Obviously, there's the view the real ending option. And you know what? At the beginning of this installment and at the end of the last installment, I lied. This was not the last enemy. The real ending has one last opponent. And believe me, that one is a doozy. There's one plot thread that has been left hanging. And it's a good end. Oh my god, the Dr. P song, the one he sings. Oh, the full version. The end of the world. I hear the rising phoenix in my dream. And the virgin child made a wish upon a star. That night her mother talks no more. Cave of hope, the end of the dream. Shining fish flashes in a stream And the virgin child loses her heart and soul That night her mother's eyes see no more When the wind blows a virgin child's gone sing a song Such a pretty melody never Oh my god, is that a good song. And if you actually pay attention to the lyrics, quite creepy, and arguably Gene's backstory. Oh, that was a trip. And that's why I stayed through the credits. So good. <laughs> One more installment left, ladies and gentlemen, but for now, I must cut. Well, we've done it, ladies and gentlemen. We have beaten No More Heroes, but we have not yet completed it. As I said during the credits, there's one more thing we need to do, and that is to view the real ending. And believe me, when we do, it is going to be a trip. We have one more boss in the game, and it's one of the cooler ones. Complete with the by far coolest insta-death move in the entire game. It's not something you're going to want to miss. We've got one more boss one more revelation, and a couple more awesome tunes. Until next time, everyone.